people use Excel will have a new favorite address. That address, XFD1048576. You say, what the heck is that? That's how big the new grid is in Excel. They go to 1.1 million rows and 16,000 columns. For those of you doing the math, that's 17 billion cells. I'll hit end down. There we are, the last row. When you go 16,000 columns over, that's enough for 46 years of weekday dates going across the spreadsheet before you run out of room. Now, with over 1.1 million rows, the new Excel can handle just about anything. By far, the most powerful feature that we have in Excel is the pivot table. And the pivot table has gotten even better in Excel 2007. If you've never tried a pivot table, it allows you to take 500, 5,000, 50,000, even now 500,000 rows of detailed data and quickly produce a summary report. Let me show you how it works. That quickly, six clicks, I took 5,000 rows of data and produced a tight summary that shows me data by product and region. How many times do you look at an Excel spreadsheet and your eyes just glaze over with all those numbers? Excel 2007 offers a brand new set of features called the Data Visualization Features. Here I have a column of numbers and really they all just kind of blend together to me. But watch what happens, you choose Conditional Formatting and Color Scales. A great new feature in Excel 2007. Yes, Excel 2007 has brand new charts, but another great new feature are the new business diagrams. There's over 80 different types of business diagrams you can create. In Excel, they're called Smart Art Graphics. We'll just take a look at some of the different smart art that you can create. Add these diagrams to your Excel worksheets, your PowerPoint charts, or your Word documents, and you'll really bring the point home. Microsoft has completely rewritten the chart engine. Before it used to be a four-step wizard to create a chart, it's now one click to create a chart. And it's so much easier to format the chart. Microsoft gives you a gallery full of professionally designed charts. If you need to change the chart, just choose something new from the gallery and you're off to the races. You need to change colors? There's a gallery of 48 different styles and 20 different sets of colors if you don't like these. If you need more control, you can go back to the other tabs of the ribbon to micromanage the chart. Charting fantastic new feature in Excel 2007. If you're building a spreadsheet for someone, why don't you add tool tips to the sales? Isn't that cool? Now look for it on the ribbon. You'll never find anything on the ribbon that says insert tool tips, but I'll show you how to do it.